Heidi. Let's chill for a little bit with some uh, Fallout 4 because I got that itch and I'm like, oh, I gotta play. <laughs> It'll last for a month, but I have to play it. And hope that it doesn't crash. And hope that nothing happens to my controller because I plugged in my headphones and it said that my controller needs an update. I'm like, the fuck, Xbox? You changed on me so much. Why would you do that to me? What time is it? Oh, that's fine. Well, uh, I was gonna go to Diamond City, but... We can, uh... I guess we can go do that. Yeah. We'll go do that. job sly right in the gut okay now they see me oh no I hit my dog <laughs> that happened I was trying to um I think it actually happened last night I was playing and I saw a farmer getting attacked by wild uh, dogs and I was like I'll save you because he was on like the sliver of health but, uh, I used vats to, uh, try and kill the doggos, and, um, actually the guy, like, in slow-mo got right in front of my shot at the right moment, and, uh, yeah, he did not make it. Sly ended up murdering him. Where'd you find an enemy? Did you get them? Okay, I'm guessing you did. Alright, let's go down here. Um, uh, it's over here. Let's go. Come on. We're just gonna stay crouched. There we go. Yeah, good job, dog meat. come now it's not that bad it's my name mom something about this place looks a tad unsafe oh, I don't know about unsafe I mean it's filled with uh, ghouls but it's not like there's bombs anywhere I call it unsafe if there's like Oh well. I guess that's technically a trap. My bad. <laughs> yeah, so, so I guess it's unsafe. You're right, Cotsworth. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I doubted you. So, so sorry. Why is there a biometric st I need all of that. <laughs> I need it all. Okay. Excuse me, Cotsworth. Jesus. Right. Hi ho. Spaghetti o. No, not that one. That one. Thanks. You got it, Cosworth. You get them. You got it, Cosy. Get it? Good job, Cosworth. Cosworth! I thought you got it. You did not get it at all. Rude. There's not one in there. But there's one that comes around this little corner. And that stupid monkey. Bleh. Die. Good job. But. 
You. Oh, you don't want to do your creepy ass thing? Too bad, Bob. Alright. I don't think there's any more. I'm gonna walk around now. Four, okay, we can wait on that. Do, 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 Search all the toilets. That's it. More kids close. Pack of cigarettes in the urinal. Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> oh, what a poor baby. Uh, you can keep your teddy bear, it's fine. I won't take your teddy bear. I'll take that medic, so. Thank you. Oh, nothing in the trash. The locket, take a toy car. Um. No, because I don't have Nick, so, uh, GG, Codsworth. Ah, oh, don't worry. Sly's fine. She don't smell a thing. She don't smell a thing. I don't want this freaking subway coin. I want the money. Give me that money. <sighs> Technically going in there will be bad. So I gotta wait till I wake up the guy. Alright, Cosworth. I do have a sniper, right? Yeah, I got a sniper. Let's try out the snipey. Oh, there he is. All right, we're gonna f him up, Codsworth. Nice. Got it. Headshot too. No scope. But oh, I missed. Codsworth, help! Thanks, Cosworth. Oh. Another one, Cosworth. You ready for another one? I missed. Cosworth, get it! I missed. Cosworth, get it! Cosworth, please. I dare say I'm slightly disappointed. I'm hoping I'm not hitting you, Cosworth. That would suck. And I don't mean to hit you, pal. I don't mean to. Cosworth, where are you going? Stick by me, pal. I'll take a bowling ball. It's fine. Take that and take that. You're an idiot. Uh. Okay. Wrath has won. Okay. Third A, maybe? Wrath. Nice. Got it. Powering up. Protectron on duty. Good job. These poor people dying from an explosion in a freaking subway thing. Uh uh. Uh uh. Too scary. Got it. Take your clothes though. 
Thanks for the free clothes. Oh, I have missiles now. Yes. Good. Good. Thank you, army man. Hey. Look alive. Where's my dog? <laughs> I have to make sure my dog didn't stay somewhere by accident. Here, I have seven missiles now, so you can take the minigun. Missile launcher. Much better. There we go. Happy. Oh, Daco, you okay? You still with me? I honestly don't know. Oh, dog meat. Dog meat, where'd you go, buddy? Well, let's hope that he's outside. We're gonna hope he went outside to go pee, Cotsworth, cause uh... Good job. But I'd really like to know where dog me went. Yeah, I hope I didn't tell him to stay outside. I'm pretty sure I didn't. Pretty sure I didn't. I'll take that, and I'll take that, and I'll take that, and I'll take that, and that, and that. Okay. Hey, Busta. Noise. You say I cleared it out, but I really didn't. Just, just saying. I technically didn't. Could just leave now, I suppose. Ooh, was that for left leg? I got right leg. Oh, I already have a left leg. Oh, but metal's better. that and I'll take that. Yeah, where's our dog Cosworth? Go find dog meat. Kinda concerned he gets stuck outside. That would suck. That would really suck. Oh. Thought there was a trap here. Guess not. Giddy up, Buttercup. Bottle. Okay. Where'd that guy go? Robot man, where'd he go? Projectron. Nice. Take that. Well, wherever he went, he didn't take care of this guy. are not happy. Uh oh. I think Project John died. 
Oh, hi! You know, I love it when that happens. I just wake up, or I just look up, and boom! Ghouls. It's like my favorite pastime. Oh, Sly, please get it. You got it, girl! That's right. I got a cause worth. <laughs> nice. Good job, Codsworth. You're a real pal. Um, I really hope dog meat is outside. I can't stress that enough, Codsworth. I, you know, I really want him to be outside. And not stuck in this building. Look, we have light. Chill the hell out. We got light. We got a party. We're fine. Ah! See, that's why I need dog meat. He gets the junk first before you, but whatever. Since he's not here, here you go. Have my junk. That and that and that and that. Don't worry, Cotsworth. I'm getting there. I'm getting there, pal. I'm getting there. Go take that. Alright. Oh, that's just the guy. That's just the helpful guy. Dog me, are you here? Dog me, were you, like, did you were you even in the building? I don't think dog me ever actually came into the building. Now that I think about it. Oh, dog me, I hope you're okay. Bingo. Yay. Do this for the experience. Shady. Damn. Tires. Ooh. <sighs> Tires. Is there like an ES? Tires. I got it. Whoops. Alright, I'm done here. Let's go tell that guy and hope that, like, dog meat is right here. <laughs> oh, dog meat, are you stuck up here? Oh, dog meat. I, I think he's outside. I think he got stuck outside. Oh boy. I heard my dog in pain. What's going on? Dog meat? God. 
the hell, man? Fuck. Oh my god, Cosworth, I'm sorry! Damn, dog meat. I'm sorry, boy. I didn't know you just stayed out here. To fight off all these fools. What? What? Oh, you got it. It's fine. <laughs> got it. It's fine. Hey. Pop shot. Oh, almost. I have too much fun in Fallout. You want a pop shot? I missed. Pop! <laughs> Just ignore that miss. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Pop! Thank you. Uh, okay, nobody's alive here. Industrial Sobbin. All the ghouls here are just dead? Oh, okay. Oh, there is a mine right there. Dog meat, be careful! I'm just gonna get that guy and we're gonna leave. No, we're gonna leave. It's a minefield over there. We're just gonna go back, tell Mr. Asshole that the job's complete, and then we're gonna go to Diamond City. Sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan. That's the plan! That is the plan. Is this a truck I can open? It's not. Sad face. Hey, asshole. That location better be cleared yeah, out. Yeah, 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 Dumbo, it's cleared out. Affirmative. Impressive. Keep proving your worth. I may start to trust you. Yeah. Now report to Paladin Dance. He said he had a mission for you. Hey, I leveled! When you're ready for another rock, you know where to find me. I'll take one. Hey there. Just when I thought you were gone for good. I take it you're ready for another mission? Yeah, sure, I, I won't do it, but I'll take it. I'm ready. Good. Here's the latest target area. I don't want to see your face until that place is clear. Bedford Station? Really? Oh god, where is that? Oh, it's up here. Okay. Uh, I think we're gonna go here next, actually. Is this where Curry's at? No, Curry's at the vault. She's at the vault. I don't know what's there then, but I could I could check and see. Alright, let's talk to Dance first. Dance! 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 Dance. Excuse me, Paladin Dance. Welcome back. I've got another mission for you. If you're I will do it, but sure. Ready. Outstanding. Over the years. The Brotherhood has sent several recon teams to the Commonwealth. The last squad went in three years ago. They never reported back. Officially, they're missing. Presumed dead. Spoiler alert, they're dead. Besides one. Was there a rescue mission? No. The Brotherhood doesn't have the resources or the manpower to conduct a search like that. Everyone who signs up for a recon mission knows the risks. Our lives depend on our training and on each other. But if a team is lost, we honor those who give their lives in the line of duty. We have a responsibility to find out what happened to them, if we can. It's been three years. They could be anywhere by now. Their insertion point was in the hills near Malden. Survey the area and establish a search pattern. Monitor your radio for distress signals. All recon teams are issued distress pulses. 
that put out a short-range homing beacon. If you can acquire a signal, you should be able to trace it to its source. Okay, okay. All right, let's go to uh these labs, maybe. If not, freaking it's good time to be a freaking get Nikki Poo. Thank you, game. Level up. Uh, so many choices. Like, why was my thing like that? It scared me. No, I don't want to do that. I want to do that. If I do that. But the other thing is over here. It's raining. noticed every single time I go down this road and every single playthrough that I do of this game it's always raining and how do I know that because if I ever do like a role play I always imagine that the character would stay in this nice big empty bus and wait for the rain to pass every single time it never fails it does not matter what day it is it does not matter what time it is it just always rains, and I don't know why. Every single damn time. Alright, what is this place? Is this the big open... Oh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I'll have... no. No, 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 no. That's the big open place, isn't it? Isn't that where the Institute's at? This look, this road seems very familiar. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I no. Let's let's just go to Diamond City, you guys. We're just gonna go the normal way. We go to Diamond City in the rain and just forget about the freaking that place. I. I, I don't want to go through that. I don't have the energy to go through that right now. That building looked very, very big. And since I don't remember what uh, what that building entails, I'm just not going to go through it. Since it's a lab, I'll wait till I get curry. Then I'll deal with it. For now, we're just going to go this way. It's nice somebody plugged up all these holes on the bridge. It's very nice to them. I 
you guys got it. I usually help. Hey, who shot me? You guys got it. I don't need to help you like I thought I did. Who the hell threw a freaking cone at me? Is that you, dog meat? How rude. Diamond City. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. And wet. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out. Is that it? Oh, look, it's the scary reporter. Ooh. I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. They really tried hard, hard on Piper and tried to make her look like Nora. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but Ooh, shiny yeah. hair. Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy. You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month. <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal. Oh, Piper. Wait a Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. <sighs> Sounds good. Let's go. Another great day in Diamond City. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that Ooh, printer scrapped that for parts. Mr. Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? Would you support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Always believed in freedom of the press. Rightly so. A true medium for the people. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, miss. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money. Settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? I can't believe you're freaking John's brother. <laughs> uh. I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah. Greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? Who would I talk to you about finding a missing person? Well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. <laughs> don't listen to her. Well... I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Ah, oh, come on, you know. A mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, there's uh, one private citizen. Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down. Usually for debts or whatnot. Now I have to get going. 
I'm sorry, Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. <sighs> this is ridiculous. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security always shrivels away when talk of missing persons comes I've up? I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> I'm impressed. Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? I think I just found my next story. Okie dokie, Piper. So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I right? I wasn't lying. I got a whole supply train coming in tomorrow. Technically, yeah. Right? No bull? Well, if that's the case, let me put a down payment on some parts for the gate. Here you go. Anyway, thanks. Welcome to Diamond City and all that. I gotta get back to work. Thanks, Danny, for the free loot. Head on inside. Oh, hey, who are you? Hey. Hi. Hi. What's up? Freaking Deacon. Think you're so slick. Wait. You ain't, Deacon. You ain't. No, 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 you ain't. Look at the kitty! Hi, kitty. Happy Halloween! Ba, 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 Piper? <gasps> read the public and be prepared. I'll read it. Hey, sweetie. Three papers from newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least we warned you. Institute? You ain't heard of the Institute? Really? Cosworth. They snatch people up in the night and no one hears from them again. Cosworth! It's all in the papers. Better read up before they grab you, too. Who's gone missing? Drifters, residents, stadium seat snobs. Seems every year or so. Someone's gone. And we all know why. So you better be careful, newcomer. Institute is out. Cosworth. They'll grab you too. Like I said, it's all in the papers. I believe you. Thanks. You are a real lost lamb in the wolf den, lady. Thanks for the paper. Right? 
Need a new Coca-Cola. Hey, Sheffield. Cola, new Coca-Cola. Here you go. That's so gracious of you, Mom. I'm sure it's not every day someone shows him such kindness. Ah, <gasps> oh, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, it's the new girl. Am I right? The new girl? Word kind of travels fast in Diamond City. What can I say? Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. So you know weapons, huh? Listen, I can sell you guns, swords, whatever. And they'll keep you alive for sure. But the real secret is in the mods. The little personal touches. Install a scope, expand the clip size, whatever. You spend time with your gear, and you'll have the right answer to every problem. Anyway, let's get back to you and what kind of protection you need. Sure. Let's take a look. Everything hand tools. Uh, well here, you can take that. And that. And that. Yeah, you could take that. And that. And that. Nice. I'll keep that, I guess. Oh, here, you could take the mods. Big boy. Oh my god. Shoots an additional. Damn. I'm coming back for that big boy. Oh, I want that big boy. Old Faithful. It does double damage if the target is at full health. That's not so bad. Reduces damage from super mutants damage from humans. That's actually pretty nice. Alright. Thank you. Oh, uh, Codsworth. Hey. You have some... Oh, you just have some minigun. Never mind then. Damn. Yeah, looks good, doesn't it? She looked damn fine in it. You? I, I don't know you. Just keep your distance. Why? Because I don't know you, and I will not serve a synth pretending to be human. So are you human? Synth? What's a synth? A synth, as in synthetic person. Those things the Institute makes look real with hair and sweat and blood and everything so are you human or not uh sure human as the day i was born well you do look human enough but i'll be watching you i have eyes like a well they're good eyes got it okay all right we can do business, but no funny stuff. What kind of business are you running here, anyway? We buy and sell anything and everything. Seven days a week, 24 hours a day. The robot takes care of customers at night. Only one I trust to do it. At least I know he's a machine. Let's see what you got. Just don't call it junk. It's junk! I could make that myself. Oh. Okay, it's junk, lady. Sorry. I hate to tell you, but it's junk. I hear there's a bar in the old theater district that's for raiders only. The combat zone. Good to see another robot in town. That chef has become to you. 
Why are you wearing like fish armor? Don't walk outside the wall undefended. High quality protection for sale. Restriction still. A new file to open. Do you have a legitimate medical concern? Or is this about a facial reconstruction service? Say what now? Facial reconstruction? What's that? Uh, it's Doc Crocker's specialty. If you're interested, talk to him about it. Just head through the door with our logo on it. No, if you have an actual medical problem, speak up. So what kind of treatments are common around here? Bandaging wounds and cleaning radiation exposure are the most common things you outsiders usually ask for. That and kicking a chem habit. I need some supplies, Doctor. Uh, let's see what I can spare. Eh, I don't really need anything. Thanks, Doc. I'll go talk to him. Oh, he's not here. Where's the doctor? Oh, he's in there. Got gems right here for you, sister. Did you say something about drugs? That's right. All the gems you need to fill out your lifestyle. Balance you out. Everyone here buys from me. Sometimes security needs a little psycho, or an engineer needs some Mentats. And heck, Lad X is plain universal. Looking for a job, if you've got one. Yeah, I got something. Looking for a mutated fern, if you find any. I hear some grows out near Forest Grove Marsh. Natural radiation sucker. Be great for cooking Rad X or Rad Away. Sweeten the deal with some money, and I might be interested. All right, How about 125 caps. Come on, make it worth my while, Solomon. You are one righteous talker. 150 caps. Mutated fern. Sounds good. Cool. Cool. <laughs> Did I talk to I talked to everybody now, right? Stop by the mega surgery sometime. Doctor. Even though I'm a doctor, I admit I have a small vice. A quick drink after work. Good luck finding that mutated fur. No problem, dude. What's with you vault dwellers in those jumpsuits, huh? Um, they're sexy. Hey. I'm not looking to make friends. Beat it. I'm done working for you. Get lost. Okay. But I wasn't some newcomer, huh? Does Talk to have it the wall in one of the history lessons. Right? What? You mean the railroad? Well, that's Dad a fairy tale, man. They don't need this. Nah, I heard from my cousin. He oh. knows a guy wow. that works it's for me. They got a code for it. Thanks. You read the paper. The freedom it's trail. The hiding among us. You're full of it, and that kind of talk is. you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... the detective... has gone missing. Picture on milk carton time? If only it was that simple, right? <laughs> Nick disappeared working a case. 
Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Who's this Skinny Malone character? I don't know much about him, but he's from Good Neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. You said Malone's from Good Neighbor? Yeah, it's a tough neighborhood. Northeast a ways. People with power there care about two things, style and body count. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Ah, Nick Ellie, where'd you go? The spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Still love how she points that out, and not the fact that he's a robot. It's really nice. Can I level? Oh, damn, I didn't level. Hey, can I, like, sleep here? No. What about Nick's bed? I mean, Nick doesn't, like... Damn. Okay. Never mind, then. Well, actually, that is Nick's bed. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just go to the inn, then. Hi, Larry. How are you doing this morning, technically, for you? <laughs> and technically for me, too. Kitty. Look at this guy. Don't move, Sim. What have you done with the real riot? Hide behind Where's you. Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family. Oh God. Put the gun down now. He's a simp. He'll kill us all. Kyle, no. Okay, show's over. There are no sins in Diamond City, hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Yeah, I've been doing alright. I've been doing a-okay. Just getting through. What the hell are you doing? I thought like she was gonna pit pocket somebody or something. But uh, yeah, she just wants to chill there. I guess that's fine. Hi! Officer? I need you to step away, Scabber. I understand, officer. I just want to know what happened. What you didn't hear the shouting? It's kind of a new playthrough. His own brother, thinking he's um. a simp. It's that newspaper's fault. It's got people all riled up, thinking their own family might be replaced by machines. Look, I'm sorry you got caught up in all this, but it's over, okay? Okay. Just go about your business like nothing happened. Better that way. What's everyone still standing around? Uh, it's kind of a new what playthrough, like um. Business? I got that like little itch just like you get with Skyrim that you want to play Fallout again. This character right here, her name's Sly. She's like my canon soul survivor. I'm just replaying her. Every time I try to create a different soul survivor and play as them, I just stop instantly. I just like Sly too much. She's too pretty and she's too cool and she's too bad, I guess. Oh, little sneaker sneaker went away. Okay. Guess that's fine. Hi. Um. Well, Kyle wasn't a synth, but I don't know about hey. you, Riley. You pulled a gun on me. My own bro. You sure you're not a synth? But what happened? I'm. I'm not a synth. I, you sure? I told him. I, I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I. Uh, I need a minute. Be sure about that, pal. All right. Well, um, everybody else is closed, so I guess I'll just uh. I want to talk to that one guy. I still have to talk to the guy. I still have to talk to the swatter guy. Nothing to see here. Abbott. Okay. I still have to talk to a few more people before I go to Piper and then Nick. Let's go. Uh. I can't believe you eat that thing. Only one thing worth buying in a dugout in, and that's the bulls. Man's gotta eat. What can I say? 
real Diamond City boy eats at the noodle stand. I like how you have the same voice. You yeah, you have the same voice. Okay, yeah, I still play this a lot too. Only on my second full playthrough though. Too much fun just running and rebuilding. Yeah, same here. I want to... I need to force myself to... Uh, play different characters so I can like side with everyone when out comes the most dangerous of all sea monsters cuz sly my lurk my lurk like two out of 10 points uh, cuz for sly wise she's um she's kind of like that basic first character where you side you you join everybody and then you pick one she picks the railroad and the minutemen I want to do like a strictly minimum, strictly. You there. We need to have a conversation. Hi, Edward. I missed you. Mwah mwah. Do I know Love you? Love you, babe. No. But I've heard of you. I'm always looking for people who know how to handle themselves in dangerous situations. I don't mind danger, so long as I get paid well enough. You will be well paid. I can promise you that. Thanks, Edward. By the way, I'm Edward Deegan. You'll mostly be working for me, but you'll need to talk to my boss first. His name is Jack Cabot. He likes to personally interview everyone I hire. He's careful like that. Come down to Cabot House in Beacon Hill and ask to talk to Jack. I'll let him know you're coming. Thanks, Edward. Love ya. I was all set up for your early stream the other day, but wasn't meant to be. Yeah. Stuff. Edward's so cool. I really hope he doesn't die. I mean, you see him shot on the floor, and then you never see him again, so it, it's kind of scary. I prefer to go to the dugout inn. Sure, I can afford the tap house, but the way those people stare at you. The way those people stare at you. Okay. Uh, I'll think of Hi there. You can order drinks and food here or at the bar. Who owns this bar anyway? The Bobrov brothers picked this place up a few years ago. I had every uh, intention of streaming. I think it was what yesterday. Maybe yesterday. Um, but I was trying to wait on a freaking phone call that never came, so, uh, it didn't happen. <laughs> Hopefully I'll hear something soon. I, I don't, Sly don't buy stuff, she just scavenges. Don't bother, pal. I ain't seen nothing. I ain't Hi! You want Jesus, bud? I killed a man for it. <laughs> no, All right, Zevron. I kid, I kid. <laughs> he is dead, though. <laughs> now, let me know when you're ready to order. So, this your bar? Damn straight it is. My brother, Yefim, and I make the best moonshine in the entire Commonwealth. We call it Bobrov's Best. Had to start renting out rooms just so customers uh, had a place to safely pass out after drinking. <laughs> Can I get a room? Let's take a look. That's what I like to hear. No, it ain't your fault. It ain't your fault, Larry. Like, Larry, trust me. You don't want to live here. Not right now. <laughs> he, he, no. You don't want to live here, not right now. Just, just stay where you're at. I do keep you in my mind, be like, God, I gotta, I gotta like stream earlier so poor Larry doesn't have to freaking stay up at five in the morning to watch if he wants to. But, uh, yeah, I don't think I can stream any earlier anymore because next week. Work will be closing at 7.30 p.m., but still, I wouldn't stream until late at night, so. It's, uh, kind of sucks, but 
soon I'll be getting two days off so I can try at least streaming one day during the day. I say, my good man, what's the house special? Who dug out here? Only the best moon shine in the Commonwealth. Bobro's best, they call it. Robot should try. See if he's strong enough to power that engine, yes? <laughs> While an alternate fuel source would be beneficial, I'm afraid I must decline. General Atomic's warranty stipulations only guarantee repairs and replacements when using the designated Mr. Handy fuel. Perhaps you miss out on once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Vadim can give you warranty as well. I don't doubt that one bit. Let's just say, should the need arise, I shall surely seek out your services and keep it at that. Drinks! The finest liquor moonshine. I just want a room. Can I have a room, please? Oh, customer. Need a room? Yeah. What's the story with this place? Not much to say. We sell food, drink, and rooms. Mainly for traders. That I mean, I don't need a room. I have, like, a camping DLC uh, mod, but... I'll do some roleplay. I wasn't paying attention to a thing you said. I'm sorry. Can you say that again? What's the story with this place? Not much to say. We sell food, drink, and rooms. Mainly for traders that come to the area. My brother Vadim runs the bar. Scarlet's our waitress, and she helps me keep the rooms clean. As much as they can be. Thank you for repeating yourself. <laughs> You're in room two, just through the door. Thanks, room two! Hey, room two. Hey, this isn't so bad. Look how nice this is. Dog meat, get in here, boy. You're allowed in here, boy. Get in here. Get in here. Cosworth, you could join too. You're just a robot. It's okay, that's what the recordings are for when I actually get the time. Don't have to work the streams around me. I was just I was just going to ask what mods you got. No, I don't have the new paid ones. I actually like never heard of the new paid ones until I started up Fallout a couple days ago when I created Sly again. Um but no, the mods I have are like None of them are cheaty. The only cheating one that I could possibly think there is is probably the uh, two followers thing, but I don't count that one because Dog Me is technically not supposed to be a follower. He's supposed to be. Even the dev said that they were going to make him like just an extra follower that you can have with somebody else, but for some reason they didn't do it, so I don't count that one. But just cosmetic stuff, some hair, the patch, uh... Settlement stuff, RP stuff. I guess this one's kind of cheaty, where you could wear whatever, like, arm, leg attachments with whatever armor. Uh, that's not really cheaty. It doesn't, like, really help you at all. Yeah, it's really just, like, role-playing stuff. I don't know if this one even still works anymore. It used to. I got a little apartment in um, Good Neighbor because Sly and Hancock are romanceable. They romance each other and uh, I love Good Neighbor. I'm like, oh, I want a house in Good Neighbor. So, Player marriage, that seems really cool. Yeah, nothing cheaty. And loyal Gage, because I love Gage and I don't like killing him. <laughs> so, yeah. Nice, just things to make it more fun. Same kind of things I have installed, yeah. I used to have so much more installed. Like, I had, uh, I had so much stuff. But I was like, you know what, no. I'm redoing it, so I deleted all of it. And I'm like, okay. I can pick anything that's that still like would fit in Fallout, but not cheaty. <laughs> and that's what I ended up with. That's all I could have. That's it. You guys coming or what? I'd like to shut my door. You know what? Fine. I don't need to shut my door. So I gotta talk to baseball guy, weird doctor guy. 
Piper? Can I get Nick? I guess. Have a nice day. Thank you. That's very lovely. I'll take that. Thank you. Hi. Who the fuck are you? Excuse me. Hey, what's your story? Mercenary, caravan guard. I'm wearing a fucking vault suit. I try to protect people if that's what you mean. Wrong birth size, blood, bullets, money, all the way. You first. What's your name? Hawthorne. And you are definitely from out of town. I know every settlement from both sides of the Charles River, and I've never seen you. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm just kicking back and sharing stories while I'm between things. I've been all over, seen vaults, pre-war ruins, and plenty of monsters. You've been to a vault? Yeah. Ever heard of Vault 81? They're standoffish, but every once in a while, they'll let new people in. Let's hear your best monster story. I'm from Diamond City. You want to talk something really scary? It's the Institute in their sense. Don't go to University Point. Trust me. You don't want to know what they're capable of. So you explore old ruins? Last place I was going to check out was Salem. Real old town farther than north. Never made it. Hey, that's a Netflix show. I have a feeling about that. It's really crazy. <laughs> See you around, Hawthorne. Later. I don't suggest watching Salem. It's, um... Yeah, it's, mm. it's a good show, but yet not. <laughs> Can't remember the name, but have a close shot mod. Uh, it's just a side diamond city, some really nice outfits and bags. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I have, I'm supposed to have one mod installed that I don't know if it adds or changes some what some of the uh, clothes look like. Okay, we're not gonna deal with back there yet. We're just gonna. I wasn't even looking at you. Shut up. Hi, Polly. Hey, Gavin. Got plenty of ramen meat on the. Wait, what kind of meat is this? You never heard of ramen? Big dumb got four. They're legs not and dumb. They're the only cattle around. Rude. Everything's fresh from the Codman family farms. Sometimes <laughs> no problem. Weird stuff from the caravans too. You probably would have never f even seen it if you're not into that kind of stuff. Weird stuff? Weirder than two-headed cow meat? Salem is yeah, basically it's about weirder than that. Myrler, uh, like witches fly, and eggs. the it's devil. Right. Ain't like you can be picky in the Commonwealth. In medieval time, that that's pretty much all you need to know. <laughs> yeah, you got the gist of it. Very rated R. I'll take a look. Sure. No, but my mom likes that stuff. I, uh... Usually whenever my mom watches a show, if I come downstairs, I'll watch a little bit of it, but I'll never, like, actually sit down. I've only actually sat down and watched a couple of shows with her, but they've been, like, not rated R. <laughs> they've been very laid back, <laughs> so I'm like... And Salem's story is just so confusing, I just, I couldn't get it. Swatta! What's a swatter? Swatta! A swatter, my friend, is a Diamond City tradition. See... It, it used to be that this whole place was a stadium, <sighs> and two teams would meet and, and play a game called baseball. One team would beat the other team to death with these things called baseball bats, and and the best bats were called swatters. True fact. Oh, really? What kind of teams were there? There was the Diamond City Demolishers. Big brutes of guys, a played in full power armor with special pneumatic arms, you know, for swinging. Then you had the Lexington Ladies, an all-female team, with Coach Bloody Mary Sue at the helm, highest kill count in the league. Ha, I could spend all day talking about the Concord Crushers, oh, or the Quincy Killmeisters, but you get the idea. 
Hey, dumbass, that's not how baseball was played. <laughs> right, little Miss Smarty Pants? If you're such an expert, how do you think it was played? Not that... Well, I was about to say not that funny, but I love baseball, so... There were balls, strikes, three bases, and home runs. You kept score by how many runners made it to home plate. Yes. None of this... I like my version. Of yeah, me too, now, somewhat. Can I interest you in these genuine, half and half, custom-made hickory swatters? Got any work? Well, if you wanna you know, help the sport, I got a lead on a stash of pre-war collector's items. Coach, quitting is for punks. Weston had an estate not too far from here. Legend says when he retired. The league presented him with a baseball, catcher's mitt, and playing card signed by all the other coaches. Oh, yeah. See where I'm going with this? I'll pay 100 caps each for those relics. What do you say? 100 caps just for some relics? Come on, if they're relics. I mean... 100 caps seems light. I need more. I like your mind. We'll make it 125 caps apiece. How's that sound? I got it. I'll, I'll a take card, that. A mitt, and a ball. Got it. I thank you. And baseball thanks you. Uh, I'll, I'll take the 125. It's fine. Word is something bad went down in the old museum of witchcraft up near Salem. Why would anyone even go there? That's called Salem. It's a weird name. <laughs> Here to pick up. Uh, talk to every. Oh no, I have to talk to the doctor. Yeah. Sly, Sly doesn't like to go too too far with the bargaining unless she doesn't like the person. But when I think it's just right. Hi. You know, this is like nothing how I would have thought. I I know your tricks, Doctor. Don't worry. Soon I'll uh. A new face. Beautiful, but not perfect. Fuck you. For a nominal fee, Doc Crocker can give you the looks you've only dreamed about before. Oh, I completed the quest. Okay, bye. You creep me out. Bye, 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 bye. No, Cosworth. <laughs> Crocker. Go back to the fairly odd parents, you stupid head. I don't need to change my hair yet. Let's go, uh. Thing. Hey, I think those Bobrov brothers are looking for you. Uh, 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 you know, fuck it. I'm not gonna talk about the wall. I am just gonna go talk to Piper. Alright, Codsworth. Let me see you for a second, bud. Oh, Codsworth. Come here, buddy. Hey. You should be okay if I just dismiss you. I shouldn't lose all that stuff, right? We're gonna hope not. I'll make a save and I'll try not to save over that. I will replay the whole Nick quest if I have to. But I want Piper. We're gonna get Piper and we're gonna freaking get Nick. Baby Nick. We're gonna get baby Nick. Oh, Piper! Glad you got by. You holding up, Blue? Blue? You can't give me that nickname yet. We haven't even talked yet. Oh, hi. Alright. Cosworth, come the fuck up. Sorry, I'm knocking down your bottles. I'm so sorry. 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 Hey, Piper. <sighs> Holding up, Blue? Blue. Why are you calling me that? Because of the blue jumpsuit you're wearing? You're a vault dweller. 
So here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. What kind of interview is this going to be? I like Piper. Who you are, get your opinion on life out there, and maybe load up a few tough questions and keep it interesting. What do you say? All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. Two to so feet. I know you're from a vault. The haunt. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait. <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? Yeah. The whole time? Yep. Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yep, first. Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The woman out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Shh. I've been having too much fun blowing things up to think about it. Gotta make my job hard for me. Huh? Yes. All right. If that's the quote, that's the quote. Hi, Mara. Well, Is it okay if I say question. Mara? <laughs> you came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? Oh, thanks. You have a good night. Thank you so much for tuning in, even for just a little bit. I super duper appreciate it. Okay, thanks, Mara. Love ya. How was Blue Stream? I heard I heard he uh made it past a million. Oh, thanks, Mara. Love you. Okay. Uh. My baby Sean was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Boo hoo. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? I don't know. Dude, I just woke up. <laughs> Probably, sure. A man took Sean. Not some shadowy group. I hope that's true. Because if they are involved, everything gets worse. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond I didn't City watch. Taylor. I haven't been able to watch it's for a week or so. Aww. But ignored in the Commonwealth. Yeah, it's been pretty I good. Pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Uh. No matter how much um, you want to give up, don't. You I remember watching Blue finish. You see him again, or uh, Som the truth. Somna, Somya, whatever. Um, Thanks. And then he started Lairs of Fear, but I couldn't watch that because I want to play it. <laughs> so I couldn't watch all of it. And then he's just playing Stardew. I don't know if he's just playing Stardew for the rest of the month or he's playing another scary game because October is almost over so uh I, I don't know from the little bit I call from the day though it sounded like he was having a really good stream okay Codsworth please don't get rid of my stuff Head my way. you keep that stuff Codsworth you keep it nice and tight okay I want Piper. Sure, let's go. Will do. Miss Wright, I, I trust you'll do your best to put the safety of my mistress before your own personal gain. <laughs> of course, Codsworth. <laughs> Jesus. Lucky for me, those two things go hand in hand. Alright, Codsworth. You want to go to Grey Garden? No, go to Sanctuary. 
I'll never remember that you're a Grey Garden. I miss Santa Sam now, all of Lair's fear as well. He sounds like he's just chilling with Stardew since he's- Yeah, yeah. I wasn't hiding shit! We're in your apartment! Okay, bye Cotsworth, let's go. Um... Yeah, he was- oh god, please, why? He was, uh... That one day, he wasn't having too much fun. Cause I think he said he had a midterm, but he slept through it. I'm like, aw, blue. <laughs> so... I think he's, uh, tired out on the- on the scares a little bit. Just a wee little bit. Bleh! Cut right in front of my face. Okay, Cosworth, get the hell out of here. Um, I'm getting Nick, right? I, I don't even remember. I have so many quests already, Jesus. I try to keep this under control. Yeah, I'll, I'll go get Nick, it's fine. Let's go get Nicky Poo. I don't blame him either. As much as the scares are so entertaining, it could be really draining too. Ah! Uh, I don't know what I want. I don't know what I want. I don't know what I want. Um. That one. <laughs> we'll go with that one. Alright, Nikki Poo, I'm coming, baby. Oh, I'm a coming, Nikki. Oh, I'm a coming. Happy Halloween. Do I get in trouble? Hold it. Happy Halloween. Bop. <laughs> Maybe out, huh? That's fine, Piper. I didn't shoot anybody. <laughs> I'm gonna head to bed from seeing you for a bit, though. Bye bye, Mara. Thank you again so much for uh, tuning in. Really, really do appreciate it. You have a very good rest, my darling. Have a very, very good rest. Soup. Did Nuka Color ever actually become a thing that you could actually try? Or is it just basically Coca Cola? Open, please! Thank you. I'm a common Nikki. I don't want to interrupt, but no red rocket. Oh yeah, cause I didn't, um. I'm sorry, Pupus. Pup, sorry. Oh God, sorry. Even though you're skin and bone, you're still cute, but you're just evil. I have to kill you, I'm sorry. Is that it? Uh, yeah, there's no red rock. Oh, I don't want mom. Because, freaking, I was about to say Cassandra. Sly don't eat dog. Put that dog back. She don't eat dog. I didn't have the red rocket because I didn't go to it yet. I went to it for dog meat, but I didn't do the workshop yet, so. I just came straight down here. Because <laughs> I want to find my kid. <laughs> That's what Sly wants to do. Uh, uh. Who the f who's Ellie? 
That must be a DLC. Hold up. Who's Ellie? Oh, Ellie. Who are you? Ellie. Are you Ellie? Who's Ellie? What's going on? Brahmin, where are you going? I'm trying to get up here to help. I can't jump. Raiders will be shot on sight. Oh. Hi. You wanna you wanna play? I mean Your friend didn't make it out too well. You wanna play? Alright, fucking fine, we'll play. I have zero chance to hit. Really, game? Stupid. Oh no, he's wearing a collar. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. No, oh, he's a dead boy now. Stop. Oh. Uh, oh fuck me. No, I guess I have to take care of these guys. I just want to figure out what the hell Ellie's shop is. It must be a freaking mod. If I, I don't know. Oh, it's a whole thing. No, no, no. I don't want to do the whole thing. No, 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 no. I really don't want to deal with the whole thing right now. I just want to go in Ellie's shop. That's all I want to do. That's all I'm going to do. I'll take that, though. Dog meat! Hey. You're my baby. <laughs> Alright, uh, Ellie? Who are you? You know you have a Brahmin out here? <laughs> no Nuka Cola over. No Nuka Cola. I, I don't know. I feel like they might have made it a thing for like a special thing. Limited time, but. I'm pretty sure it was. If they did, it was probably just Coca Cola. <laughs> That's where the shop is. Oh. Ah. I mean, for a clothes shop, why the hell are the mannequins naked? Shouldn't they have clothes on? But, oh. <gasps> Look at the kitty! What a pretty kitty! What a pretty kitty! What a pretty. Oh, here's some clothes. Oh, that's cool. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Do some shopping around. Oh, hi! You look badass. Nice, nice, nice. 101. Interesting, interesting, interesting little Easter egg. I can't take anything? Oh, I guess it's okay. I hope I can't knock anything down. That would suck. Elijah, how are you doing, my man? Hi. The only way you get old in this job is assume everyone's out to kill you. Make a move and I'll end you. Wasteland. Okay, just just wanted to chat. Ooh, that looks cool. The best of time store in the Commonwealth. I'm Ellie, and that's Elijah. He's the dangerous one. I'm the talented one. Are you also blind? I'm good at outfits, bad with people. So, you buying or what? What kinds of things do you sell? Clothes I mashed up, combined, scavenged, and made look amazing. I also have a schematic for a custom clothing workbench, and some notes about armor designs, if you're interested. And I specialize in vault suit modifications. I've got a few that's, minutes that's to browse. That's No refunds. <laughs> no refunds! I bet that's the voice of the creator, isn't it? You buy the mags and then and can then craft them yourself with the new bench. Oh! Oh, well, how much is it? Oh, why is it so much money? Uh, so I'm assuming I buy this stuff. Can I just buy schematics and then I have everything, or no? I 
accessories, companions, raider, vault suit, alphas, armor jump suit, armor vault suit. There's a lot of stuff. Accessories, companions, raider, wasteland ish. I'm guessing I just buy this. Hold on, Ellie. Let me just look around some more. Oh, that's a mint thing. Oh, look. You got even little, like, actual fish for your cat. That's cute. Hey, I'll take that pit boy. Is this another Easter egg? No, it's still 101. No, there were other vaults. What the hell does that say? Oh, Skyrim. Ha! <laughs> nice. Uh, Elijah's Christ. Handy, aren't ya? This is one of them times you save the game, buy something to see what it looks like. Yeah! You know, that, that's a pretty good point. That's a pretty good point. Seems mostly everything is leather. I apparently have it. Oh yes, yeah, the money. I guess I could just buy some leather. Com what's companions? Kate's punk outfit. What? Piper's field research outfit. Okay. First the two raider. Ooh, skimpy. Vault suit, tunnel snake, vault wheatslander. Wow, this is refreshing. You look like an actual paying customer. Oh, I haven't paid for anything yet. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. You got leather I can buy? Don't mind Piper Did just going through help? your terminal. It's fine. Just ignore her, please. Uh, I can buy leather. 500? No. I'm stingy. Sorry. I'll come back later. <laughs> Sorry. I'll come back with my own damn leather supply. What the fuck you going through the terminal for? I can't go through the door. Excuse me, Piper. I want to be nosy. <laughs> Do not read. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. We got a little story here. Wait, is that the, like, the right... Yeah. Those rumors about the Great Commonwealth turned out to be just that. Baseless rumors. I can't believe we left the safety of Rivet... City, damn you, Bannon, just to end up in the ruins of Boston outside a town, constantly being attacked by damn super mutants. There is no sign of this institute, their superior technology or wealth, nothing other than boogeyman stories these people use to scare children to behave better. Elijah had gotten sick from radiation poisoning, but we managed to get inside Diamond City, and he's being treated there for the next few days. They said they allow us to visit, but they'll not let us set up shop there. I don't have enough money to buy a house either, so we're sh sort of stuck outside the stadium for now. I found a nice old Fallon's right outside the stadium. This place needs proper cleaning, but at least it's relatively safe. With What with the DC guards and turrets all over the front yard, I might stay here for a while. Why is every time I come across already have an established armor merchant? Huh, well... We've bought a Brahmin and have started to make regular trips to some of the Commonwealth settlements. One was entirely inhabited by robots and another one had nothing but ghouls. Hey, that robot one is mine already. 
It was quite spectacular. The robots, of course, wouldn't buy any clothes, but we traded some spare parts. We also managed to scavenge a lot of cool items for the shop and set up two turrets of our own. Place feels secure now, even with the occasional vicious dogs that stalk people on the path to DC entrance. The DC guards like to stop by for coffee sometimes during the patrols. I might need to find more chairs and set up something like a cafe corner here. This place is starting to feel like home. Not sure if it's tied to the shop mod or an another, but a lot of random sellers and raiders have now started turning up in my game with these outfits on, so you can maybe get some that way. Okay, so in here, time to run, have fun. No prop! Have a very good uh, sleep or rest of the day, Larry. Have a very, very good day. Thank you for tuning in, like always. I very, very much appreciate it. Have a good one. Got food poisoning from robots noodles. What the fuck? Note to self, never eat Takahashi's again. Aw! I'm glad I didn't buy any soup. Our caravan got attacked by a damn death claw when returning from slog. Ooh. Elijah got hurt really bad. I managed to protect myself. I hope to catch you again too. Bye bye, Larry. Thanks again. Elijah got hurt really bad. I managed to protect myself well enough and get him back home and to Dr. Sun. But he was losing a ton of blood and needed a transfusion. It was terrifying. Thankfully, we shared the same blood type and I was able to help him. Perks of being siblings. Aw, cute. He's recovering from it now, but I have decided to keep the shop closed for the week while I take care of him. He's in no condition to guard anything and my face hurts like hell. Oh, and some customers tried to sneak into the back room last week. We'll have to start keeping that door locked. Oh yeah, I want to get in the back room. No one here buys vault suits. I don't get it. I have at least three boxes of vault 101 suits and a bunch from 114. Bought from some thugs in good neighbor. Ha! But no one seems interested in them. I tried asking if people in, people in vault 81 need any, but they complain about the wrong number, obviously. Vault suits remind me of my friend. I haven't heard from Lone Wanderer for a while, even though Daisy's friend's caravans have been the capital wasteland numerous times this past year and I've sent a few holotape recordings as letters. Sure hope nothing's wrong. I saw my first synth yesterday that promoted me to get back to writing my diary near the Watts Consumer Electronics Building. It was one of the old toaster types, not like those creepy human looking ones. I managed to see it before it saw me, saw us, so I had Elijah snipe its head off. Can't take any chances. Interesting. Interesting. Shoot. I will not shoot. <laughs> let's let's not get hasty here. Um Dogman, did I give you a teddy bear? I don't think I ever gave you a teddy bear, mister. Where did Elijah go? Or not Elijah. We really need to speak to your tailor. And that outfit is so twenty seventy seven. <laughs> You're cute. You're cute. Let's see what you got. Yeah, we really need to get you out of that. Damn. All right, Ellie, let's chill for a second. Armored jumpsuit. Armored vault suit. Well, armored vault suit already seems better. And it's cheaper. Lionel's tea and jumpsuit. Does that mean it's only for male? Um, I don't know. I'll wait. I'll come back, Ellie. Don't worry. I can fast travel here, Ellie. It's fine. I can at least get to vault. Uh, to the vault. <laughs> I get Nick. I forget what number it is. Now, 
I freaking wasted so much time at Ellie's shop not even doing anything. I'll come back, Ellie, I promise. I promise. And my game loads, that'd be nice. Maybe it'll load? Hello? Game? Hello? I don't think you froze, cause uh, the music is still playing. Hello? Uh, hello? Assume that you froze and just quit <laughs> and get back in it. Weird. No, no, I just want to get in the game. I don't want to watch anything. Thank you. Why did- why did you not work? I just want to get to the vault. At least. garage will never look that cool. Before leaving your vault, get prepared with up to 40% savings on add-ons and up to 50% off creations. I'm assuming the whole creations things is like... It's like mods, but it's mods that you can buy and they don't like affect your achievement getting. That's the only thing I could think of that would make actually actually make creation labs useful. Cause I mean if you buy, like actually buy a mod, but yet it still blocks achievements, that kinda sucks. But I just have to assume that's what it means. You can still get achievements but have a couple mods installed. But you gotta pay for it. I do still need to get achievements. I never got the, uh, all of the Nuka World achievements. I could do that some other day. There's so many. So many. Not now. Suit yourself. <laughs> Pun intended. Funny, Ellie. Okay, can I, like, leave your shop now? And, uh, actually get out? <laughs> Oh, I hate Assaultrons. They're the worst. Sad booby. Aw. Hey, I actually got outside. Nice. Okay. Which way <gasps> to that way? Do 
Follow me, please. Just follow me. Just follow me. We're not going anywhere special. We just want to get to this place. Then call it a night. Public library, nice. dog meat. God, I keep doing that. I don't want it. Go away. I'll take that. Okay, so where's the danger? I'm sorry, Papu. Excuse me, Piper. Jesus. No, 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 no. I don't deal with you, you don't deal with me. Just chill. Piper, don't do anything rash. Piper! Come on, let's go. Let's get out of here. So many baddies. Cuper's Comics. Oh, it's a comic book store. Ha ha. That's where I go for the silver shroud stuff. Which I'll get later. It's alright, Piper. It's alright. We're not gonna do anything rash. Just We're just gonna chill. We are going that guy, right? Okay. Okay. It's all right, Piper. journey's end. Alright, well let's focus on Nikki Poo. Oh, a Keppel. Alright, we made it. Seen better days, it? it has. Is dog meat here? I swear to God, dog meat. Dog me, let's go. Psst. You okay? Come on. Alright. So we're all here. We 
We got dog meat. Where's Piper? Is Piper stuck now too? Look, I want the whole gang here. So that way I know where we're at. When I play next time, probably on my own time. Dog meat, get your ass back over here, I swear to god. Please, dog meat. Oh, come come back here. Alright, good. Okay, good. This is where I wanna be. Thank you. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I'm not gonna shoot you. Okay. So, I'm gonna end the stream here. Thank you to everybody for joining and chatting. Thank you to Larry and Mara for chatting for a bit. Um, very fun. Like I said in my post, I'm gonna stick to this week. I'm gonna try to stick through for the rest of the year. See how I feel. Hopefully something turns out good tomorrow for the thing I was worrying about all last week, which made me not able to stream. But we'll see. If not, I'm not going to worry about it anymore. And I'm just going to focus on work and streaming. That's going to be it. So yes, thank you again to everybody for watching. Uh, tomorrow I will be streaming. Uh, right now I have planned Mass Effect, but we'll see if... I have enough energy to do Horizon or if I'll play more Fallout, I don't know. Uh, I'm not gonna promise that it'll, if I play Fallout again, it's gonna leave off right here because I I play on my own time too, whenever I want to, because I have that itch. I don't want to just play when I'm streaming, so who knows, maybe tomorrow morning I, I'll probably end up playing, I'll probably get Nick, and if I stream it again tomorrow night, uh, it might be killing Kellogg or going to Good Neighbor or some. Some. It'll be somewhere between there. Or it'll be Mass Effect. Some. It'll be some. But I will be streaming. Okay. So I'm going to end the stream here. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye! Bye!